Okay, we're going to go through now on how to set up animated icons. <clears throat> Once you have Rocket Docket installed, you're going to need to follow these steps. First, you'll need to make sure you have permission to modify the Rocket Docket folder, or changes will not take effect when you close your Rocket Docket or restart your computer. So, first, you're going to find the Rocket Docket program file. It's going to be located in your C drive. Underneath Program Files, scroll down to where it says Rocket Docket. Next, you're going to right click on that and go to Properties. From Properties, you're going to select Security tab. And you're going to go down here to where it says Edit and select Edit. You want to choose your name and make sure that all these are checked to give you full control of the folder. Once you've done that, hit, ex hit Apply and OK. Now you can make changes to the folder. Okay, so once you have that completed, the next step is to go ahead and get the program that allows you to have animated docket. I have those available on my website, so we're just going to go there. It's www.myicomputer.com. Go down to the tabs where it says free and go down to Rocket Docket. There you have a list of instructions on how to complete these steps. I'm going to go to the link section, Animated Icon Docklet. Go ahead and click on that, it'll bring you up to this website. Then you're going to go here, Animation Docklet, and you're going to download this. Go ahead and save it to a file. Okay, so once you have that ready, you're going to unzip this to your Rocket Docket program file. So we're going to open the containing folder for this. Once we've located it and the folder comes up, we're going to right click, go down to Extract All. Then you're going to look for, browse for your Rocket Docket program file. It's going to be underneath my computer and the C drive, or whatever the drive name of your, of your computer is, underneath Program Files, and you're going to select Rocket Docket. That's where you're going to put this folder. So go ahead and click OK, and it'll install it into there. I already have mine installed, so there's no need for me to do that. So we're going to go and locate the file. Go to your C drive. Underneath Program Files, go down to Rocket Dock, double click, go to Docklets, and you can see that you've, you've unzipped the file into this animated shortcut. Once you have that done, all you simply need to do, once you have that extracted into the folder, you're going to go up here to Rocket Docket, right click, Add Item, and go to Animated Shortcut. Now you're going to want to configure this shortcut. So simply go to the shortcut, right click, Configure Shortcut. The information that's in the box next to Path, you're going to want to highlight that and delete that. Then you're going to want to push the button and choose the program you would like to operate with this icon. Go ahead and rename it and give it a title. And click OK. Now this icon is associated with Firefox. Go ahead and hit that and the browser comes up. In order to get additional animated icons, first you need to create a folder called Animated Icons in your Rocket Dock. You're going to select the file, go to your C drive, go to Program Files, Scroll down to Rocket Dock. Select Icons. And you want to create this file right here. You're going to name it Animated Icons. This is where all the animated icons that you get is going to go. So the next thing you want to do is go and get the animated icons. So at this website, www.myicomputer, 
Animated.com. Just select the link, go to Additional Animated Icons, and it'll bring up this website. We're going to look through here and find an icon that we'd like to use. We're going to select the Animated Plasma 3 Plasma window. Goes through the list of instructions on how to install that. Um, you can also follow the instructions I'm giving you or at my website. You're going to want to download this file. Once you have this file downloaded, you're going to locate it. You're going to right click on it and click Extract All. Go ahead and extract it. Know where you have extracted it to. Now that it's extracted, you need to place it into the animated icon folder that you created earlier. So we're just going to go and locate the program files, Rocket Dock. Double click on the icons, and there's your animated icon folder. So now you need to drag and drop the icon you just downloaded into this folder. Go back to the folder, double click on the animated, and there's their file, Electric Window. You're just going to simply take it and drag it and drop it into... I already have that done, so we're not going to do it. Now you can go back to your rocket docket. Exit back out of here. On the animated icon, you want to configure the settings by right-clicking, hit Configure Shortcut, and go to the Set Image button. This will bring up a list of icons that you have on your computer. You're going to want to hit the plus button and go to Animated Icons. And we're going to find the electric window that we just downloaded. I set that as our new image, Electric Window. Click OK. Go back to the Configure Animated Shortcuts window. Click OK. And your icon is changed. So I hope this helps you set up Rocket Box. Thanks for watching.